Hi, Mike. Say I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Hi, Matt. It's nice to see you. Hi, Matt. How are you? Okay. Hope you were here. We miss you. Okay. So you're on. You Go. Go. Hey, Matt. How are you? We miss you a whole bunch. Oh, get Hope lost. you get home soon. Turn around. How's it going? Just we miss you. We love you. I love you, Matt. I miss my hugs on Sunday mornings. Ready? Okay, everyone just John Braga, get over here. One, two, three. We love you. That will cheer you guys up a lot. Like a real lot. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, Nikki. <laughs> no, are you kidding me? <laughs> well, now that it's on. <laughs> what the heck? How did you do? I love you too. Don't quit. I know that.
video one? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 
I knew that was gonna work. We got one right here. Yeah, I knew. He was at home the whole day. You did you did you, you know what I told you. I told you. I'm like shaking. Be nice. Can I see it? Hold on, I'm still recording. I can break the kids. Now I gotta go buy one. Did you know you coming? Did you know? You liar, you did She didn't know. She didn't know. Why did you don't even, don't even, don't even hit me. You, you, you. <laughs> it's good to be home. Look at that right there. Oh. Let me get my whips about myself. I think we're going to try to do this about uh, two months ago. Before Christmas. Before Christmas. Yeah, and, oh yeah, by the way, I got your cards and... Uh, that was great, and I appreciate that. Uh, anyway, we were going to do this about two months ago for Christmas, and uh, for whatever reason, time and all didn't it didn't work out. So we kind of concocted this little plan to uh, shock these two, and then I got three more we're going to shock tonight. So uh, I'll tell you a little bit about what I do. And then I'll just kind of open it up with questions, and some things I might be able to answer, some things I might not be able to tell you. Uh, this was my third tour, and uh, first two was in Iraq, and then this this one that I'm on now, uh, I'm at what I call the Tan Candy Land, because uh, I don't have to worry about getting shot. Uh, I go to work from eight to. From zero eight to about 1700, 1800 every day. And uh, I'm the S4, logistics officer for our, uh, for our group. Uh, I'm part of the 1108 TASM G Theater Aviation Sustainable Maintenance Group. And what our guys do is they provide aviation maintenance to the theater. We are a theater asset. And honestly, uh, I'm a major. And I'm, I'm actually like a private first class over there because there's majors running out the wild zoo. 
Uh, as a matter of fact, I was sitting in the uh, chow hall. I guess it was Thursday, and I counted 49 06s. And an 06 is a full bird term. 49 of them. And that, that just don't happen very often. But uh, where I sit, I actually work for a full bird colonel, and he works for a one-star general. But, uh, so we've got a sale in Kuwait. There's about uh, 77 of us in Kuwait. No, I'm sorry, 85 of us in Kuwait and 77 in Afghanistan. And I uh, told my wife, Naomi, yesterday, when I get back, I'll be home for two weeks, and then I'm going to make a trip to Afghanistan and do a battlefield circulation to the three detachments that we have there. And what my job is, is, again, our guys do theater aviation sustainment on helicopters. All models. The Black Hawk, the Chinook, the Apache, the Kyle Warrior. And, uh, but <clears throat> we are a theater, um, theater asset, <coughs> meaning that Colonel Berry, who works for General Ladu, who is the AMC, Army Material Command, Southwest Asia Commander. When she tells him, I need this, our boys jump. And that's what we do. Uh, I've never been at the level that I'm at now. I've got, uh, I've got... Does that make a better day for you there, Mom? Does that make a better day for you? I think you used my big good day. Did you show her the Big sign? Tears on my uniform. <laughs> Those are unauthorized. Well, see, I, I got on a plane, and then it flew. Then I got to Houston, and then it flew again. And that's weird, I ended up in Tampa. And then he was at the airport. And, and then we ended up at his work. What a great surprise, huh? <laughs> you I didn't know anything. You're in trouble, mister. It's going to be a good day, Mom. You're so like Is that why you said that? Yes. You knew. I kept telling you. She, her you and I were the only ones that knew. Blake didn't even know. <laughs> Nobody else knows either. I didn't even know. Probably the best reaction ever. You just like spontaneously just like, oh, I'm busted. <laughs> <laughs> Your head exploded or something. We were trying to think of a way to do this. I was going to have her lay on the bed Wait, you were going to come into the message. bed. Does that make a better day for you there, Mom? Does that make a better day for you? Chad DeFrady's mother called me a month ago. We talked about the marriage proposal Chad wanted to do. His potential bride had no idea he was coming home or was preparing a most unique proposal. But first, we needed the help of a local sheriff. Chad DeFrady sat alongside Christian County Sheriff Bob Kinderman. 
The two were waiting for Jennifer Rogers to get off work. After she leaves the high school, we'll try to follow her to a safe location and pull a traffic stop. Before the traffic stop began, Chad DeFratis admitted that he was nervous about his surprise trip home and his even bigger surprise wedding proposal that was just minutes away. I'm much more nervous about this than, you know, I've been shot at and mortared and, you know, it's, this is much more nerve wracking. Jennifer Rogers' nerves must have been a little rattled as she talked to the sheriff. Inside the waiting police car, Chad DeFratis was also trying to calm down. Listen to my shaky voice. And then Chad DeFratis made his move. The soldier was armed with only a CD player that would play the couple's favorite song. Couldn't have pictured it any better. Woo! We couldn't have pulled it all off without the help of Sheriff Bob Kinderman. Thank you, Sheriff. Also, thanks to Chief Photographer Kevin Huey. We had two cameras going on that shoot. I had one, but I could hardly focus through the tears. I think Don's yeah, the no, same kid, way. no kidding, Scott. Man, that's really emotional. <laughs> I'm a little emotional. choked up as well. That was a great story. She's so small. Yeah, you're. <laughs> she looks huge. <laughs> Come so big. Come here. Come here. Oh my goodness. You're so big. Look at you. Oh my god. It's been so long, hasn't it? Hasn't it? Oh. All right. Say flowers. <laughs> I told you I'd see you, right? <laughs> Last night. Where have you been? I was a drawing waiting to surprise you for Christmas Eve.
Surprise! Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I told you there was more to come. <laughs>